talk about when I was a scout. If I close my eyes a little bit, it's like it helps me bring back uh, visually, you know, uh, it does the scenes that I remember. But I remember being a scout. Scouts go in ahead of the main troop uh, to make sure we don't get ambushed by the Nazis and a lot of Hitler youth, who could have called the Hitler Jugend, were being used by the Nazis then to ambush us, uh, snipe at us when we were starting to enter in town. So I was a scout with another fellow, and uh, this particular day we got under fire from a second floor ledge, and I was able to get a few rounds off with my M1 made a hit, and this perpetrator hit the ground, and we ran up. Santana Reese, Reese was my the other guy, and they ran up and saw her laying on the ground this handsome, blonde, young, blue-eyed soldier, very young. We were, I wasn't old, but I mean, he looked like 15 or 16. Later realized in my mind he was probably a member, as I said, what they call the Hitler Jugend or the Hitler Youth. Uh, the, the Nazis were employing these young teenagers. They all looked alike to us. Maybe it was like the beginning of cloning because they all looked blonde and blue-eyed. I think that was part of Hitler's idea to have the pure uh, white Aryan race, blue-eyed, blonde. But, but this young fellow's laying there, no pulse, and near the body was a helmet. And I looked at the helmet, and inside was a picture of an elderly man and a woman. And underneath was a, a scribble, like in, a, in German, Wir liebe dich, Mutti und Vati. I knew enough German uh, that that was, we love you, mom and dad. And then I remember walking back to the outfit with Santana. We both looked at each other, and he said something like, college boy, this damn war sure is a bitch. I knew what he was thinking, what I was thinking. This was a young boy, even though it was the enemy. And even though I knew uh, he would have killed me if he saw me hiding behind this panzer tank, he didn't see me. And I did my job, and I, and I did what I was supposed to do. I couldn't get the fact that I killed this young teenager that wasn't going back to his mother and father. And I kept seeing that picture, one of my nightmares, of that mother and father and that picture inside his helmet. So that was me. I, I killed my share. I did my share. And I never, I never enjoyed it. I'll tell you that. Not once ever. <laughs>